Hey everyone, today we're going to do this fun and fast five minute Easter cheek art. I'm going to start out by using the Krivlin Gem Metallic Rainbow Cake and I'm just going to use the curved side of my sponge to load up some of the metallic orange and yellow and I'm just going to pounce it around in a circle on my cheek. This is going to kind of simulate a um, sunset effect. Next I'm going to use the Tag Teddy Bear One Stroke and my 1 inch angled brush and I'm just gonna pull a straight line down for the cross and then I'm gonna flip my brush to the other side, leaving the tan in the middle. And then I'll do the same exact thing um, for the other part. I'm just gonna do a line across and then flip my brush and use the darker brown on the bottom. Next, I'm gonna be using Tag Sophia's Crown One Stroke in that same brush. I'm mostly just loading up the purple with just a little tiny bit of the metallic gold in there. And then I'm gonna swoop across a U shape. This is gonna be like the purple fabric that's draped over the cross. And then I'll come down and make the fabric coming down behind the cross on both sides, coming down to a point. And I felt like I needed just a tiny bit more yellow and orange behind the cross since I made it a little bit longer, so it's no problem. I just went back in with that same sponge and pounced in a little bit more. Next, I'm gonna be taking the Boost stencil in the Easter set and I'm gonna be using the grass on both sides. I've just got a little bit of global dark green on my sponge and a little bit of Krivlin neon green as well, just for a gradient effect. So I'm just doing the grass on both sides of the cross. And then I'll come in with my same sponge and just connect the two underneath. Next, using a number one liner brush and some Global Strong Black, I'm just gonna come in and outline the entire cross shape. I'm making sure to avoid the fabric sections. I'm gonna come back in and outline those with some darker purple. And next, I've just loaded up some darker purple. This is a superstar purple, and I'm gonna come in and outline the fabric with some dark purple. And for some extra dimension, I'm just gonna go in with some wolf white on a number one liner brush again and make little highlights throughout the design. And that's pretty much it. This is a super fast and super simple Easter cheek art that you can do um, for any event. I hope you guys like this. Thank you so, so much for watching. Be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more fun face painting tutorials. I'll see you guys next time. Have a happy Easter.